again, my name is Gabe Zona. This is the 21st of January 2019. Read an interesting article on the Huff Post. It was posted on the 21st of January, written by Haley Miller, that's M I L L E R. Title Fox and Friends Apologizes for Airing Graphic That Implied Ruth Bader Ginsburg Died. Fox News host Steve Ducey blamed the technical error for the image which incorrectly suggested that the Supreme Court Justice had died. Fox and Friends apologized Monday after airing a graphic that incorrectly implied Supreme Court Justice blaming the mix-up on a technical error. The image showed the dates 1933 to 2019 under Ginsburg's name, and next to her portrait, it flashed on screen for a few moments before cutting to host Ainsley Earnhardt's interview with a college professor about campus culture. Later in the show, the hosts acknowledged the error. Alright, so what they flashed again is a picture of Ginsburg, and below that it said 1933 to 2019. I don't know what they apologized for. I'm pretty certain that that's probably a very true photograph with respect to those dates. God, but you got 11 months to go? And didn't she have two cancerous lesions removed from her lungs? You know, I did a video and I talked about cancer the way it metastasized. She had colon cancer. And generally speaking, cancer doesn't start necessarily in the lungs. It's carried through other organs, through the lymph node systems and through the blood systems. So the fact that she had cancer in her colon, it metastasized in other parts of her body. So I believe that 1933 to 2019 will in fact be accurate. Later in the show again, the host acknowledges for the error. We apologize, said host Steve Ducey. A technical error in the control room triggered a graphic of Ruth Bader Ginsburg with the date on it. What kind of technical error could trigger that, huh? We don't want to make it seem anything other than that was a mistake. That was an accident. We believe she is still at home recovering from surgery. Big mistake. We apologize, Earnhardt reiterated. Big mistake. A Fox News spokesman told Huff Post that the technical error animated from the graphic team. Hmm. <laughs> Ginsburg, 85, underwent a pulmonary lobotomy for two malignant growths in her lung last month. Operative word, malignant, not benign, malignant. It takes one cell to continue regenerating cancer. She continued to recover from surgery, which was dubbed a success. You know, I sure like to hear from some cancer surgeons, some specialists, but I think it's total bullshit. She's probably full of cancer. She missed oral arguments this month for the Supreme Court's first case since her operation. It was the first time she missed arguments she was appointed to the High Court in 1993. The Supreme Court announced January 11 that Ginsburg's recovery is on track. Yeah, one foot on a banana peel and the other one in a coffin. Post-surgery evaluation indicates no evidence of remaining disease and no further treatment is required. Court spokeswoman Kathleen Arbert said in a statement. Like I said, we've got 11 months to go. Personally, I don't believe that she'll make it to the end. Do you? <laughs> the link will be attached. Thanks for listening. Fox need not apologize. And I told you why.